In today's update, we're going to deep dive into the charts of Polygon as Matic has been doing tremendous in the past period. It is one of the Binance coins which is usually going great with FTX. It's often Solana that goes along with FTX, but with Binance coin, it is actually Matic. And we have been seeing that Matic has been breaking above a dollar as there is also fundamental growth surrounding the actual product project. And that's what we're going to discuss today in the charts as the charts are looking great and there's a ton of opportunities that you could be looking at when you're looking into the markets but before we continue make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to this youtube channel also check out our trade letter which is free three times per week to make you grow your portfolio and when we're talking about portfolios you can follow mine we are up 30 percent for this month and you can follow mine if you join our premium membership which you can do for free for one month if you sign up through bybit now, when we're looking at Matic, Matic is one of the coins like Binance coin um, that is going to do great and is actually already doing great. So it's time to start looking into charts where we can find the potential entry points, which are quite easy to follow through as it's um, based on the higher time frames and therefore you can navigate quite easily. So let's head towards the charts. So when we're looking at Matic, we can definitely argue that there is a significant uptrend since the low which was created in June and we all remember why the markets have been falling through in May and June as we've had the uh, Luna crash and therefore the Celsius bankruptcy uh, which is currently also putting a ton of fat on FTX as FTX is getting what they deserve as they have been trying to get Celsius down. In that way, we're looking at a market which has been falling through and Matic has been falling from $1.40 all the way towards $0.35 cents, and now it's back towards the region where it came from, which probably is going to happen with all the markets further. So in this case, Bitcoin is still down approximately 45% from the actual level where Luna crash started to happen and Matic is already back up towards those regions through which the assumption can be made that we can actually start finding strength on Matic and maybe get a new all-time high when Bitcoin gets towards 30 to 40k and that goes through the fundamental growth that we have on Matic as a whole. In that case, we are looking at a, um, a big breakout for Matic. I was trying to get a flip going on 84 cents, which we couldn't. And therefore we are looking at a case where we are just saw a big expansion all the way towards the crucial support level from back in that period. So we do see this entire level at $1.30, which is actually a sure trigger if you want to trade against the trend, or if you want to stay in your spot long positions that you want to cover the actual value of that you take a short position to hatch temporarily and those profits that you make from the short you can buy back into matic if the market starts to correct even more in that case we are looking at a big runner in which we ran from 83 cents towards the level at one dollar 33 and now we're just consolidating in which based on the daily time frame we are looking at a potential retest around a dollar and if we go lower left around 94 cents is definitely the trigger to look at if we get those regions the next big breakout is going to break the market back into this region um, we got here and then i think that we're going to overshoot because we are taking all the liquidations above the recent uh, resistances and therefore we're going to get into a territory where it starts to overshoot just like we have been seeing here as well in that case the regions around 95 the cents and one dollar are the regions to look for longs and then you're going to target the range resistance here at 185 and two dollars because those are the regions where we most likely going to overshoot so there is definitely an argument to make that you could begin looking at potential runners of 50 percent to 100 percent on matic when we're looking at the lower time frames we are looking at a beautiful re a retest here at 113 that has to consolidate and has to keep up if we do then we are looking at that breakout if we don't then i'm looking at long positions around 97 cents in order to continue the markets so that's what we're looking at with Matic and I think that we're going to look at a potential breaker towards the all-time high.
I hope you have been enjoying this small market update on Matic. I'll be back tomorrow with fresh new updates on Bitcoin and the markets. And we're going to dive into another altcoin during this week. So make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to this YouTube channel as we are back with the daily content. Also, stay calm. Don't do stupid shit. It's time for CPI later this week. So be ready for a ton of volatility. We're going to dive into that in the coming days as well. And I'll see you again soon. Ciao.